All right, viewers, uh, we are back. Uh, so this is now after the storm. The squall line ended about 30 minutes ago. So um, as you can see here, you can see how high it was before. This is still just trickling from up here. You can see how deep it was by how high the uh, the wall debris, debris dam slash how high it's built up on the sides there. It's been about an hour since I, uh, before I last came out for the other two parts. I recorded the, um, this is still the same day, um, April 4th, which is just about an hour after, but yesterday, April 3rd, I had did a video, that which is part one, where, um, this was before all this happened. Of course, this was totally unexpected. As of now, we have about <clears throat> three inches of rain. Some fell through the area within like a one hour period. So it's kind of a lot. So well, the woods are even drained down because they were, it was all flooded in there. It's all drained down. Yeah, it, it's not raining, it's just the wind blowing the trees and the water falling off of them. So, but it, it's not raining anymore. You can still see all that water in the field there. Running a lot now. They are building a house over there, so there's going to be a lot of fall because of the gutters and stuff. It's not yet graded, so to say. So it's just going to all flood down here from a, from that construction site. So that might be also why there's a little bit more water here. Not sure. Oh, look, you can see where it's just kind of going around. See some ponding water all down through here. Now this is usually not normal. It, it will flood, but it'll drain out. But of course, this little stream right here is probably backed up because we got a lot of these uh, pine trees up here, and all these pine needles keep backing it up. Wow, look at this! You can see how high it was before up on the, the edges there. And look, remember this earlier? Look how low this has done got. You can even see how that's 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 all debris from uh, debris. <laughs> you see, it's no longer just flowing across here; it's all draining down into here. See, under normal circumstances, it drains right through here and just goes right down into here. But during a torrential rain event, it just it, it does not care. Of course, it can't do nothing anyway because it's just too much water. So you can tell how high from that it's built up there. You can even see the uh, the uh, the marks from the the debris of how it's just you know been the the water levels of it. <clears throat> yeah, look at that. There's a little debris dam right there of pine needles. Now, I usually do I do usually unclog all this from time to time, but it's just really no point because no sooner I uh, unclog it it just gets clogged right back up with debris especially during the, when there's strong wind wind events and stuff you get leaves and sticks and stuff that get thrown back you know they get washed down back in it so there's really no point in just this i haven't messed with this in a while so as you can see it's still flowing pretty nice nicely so yeah you know, so you can see how high all these debris dams the water marks and stuff is left behind you can tell how high this how high this got. Look, this is backing up so much it's flowing right down through here. All that submerged. You can see it right through there. Right there. Look at this now. Look at that. Look how low this thing got. I just stepped on a stick. This was all the way back. All this was underwater. This draining here. Now I dig, dig, ah. I did dig this by hand. All this. All the way down there. 
from here all the way down there because kind of before it would just go out everywhere but I did that to kind of help it guide guide along and this is still clogged up see like this it's all clogged up by leaves I'll probably drain I'll pull all that out And I can see the creek from here, so that's... Uh, I can already tell you right now, it's going to be pretty bad down here. Holy crap. This looks pretty bad. Oh, wow. It's bad. <clears throat> it's pretty bad down here. You see it? Wow, holy crap. Wait till you see this. Look at this. All this is underwater right here. Just is connected with the creek, so it, look at all that. Just completely underwater. Wow. And I can hear the motorists up on the road here, the bridge. I can hear them driving through the water. Wow. I can't even go too far because it's so deep. That is crazy. Look, we were standing over here. We were standing back that way. Everything is completely submerged. I would go take a walk back there, but it's so deep. I, I, I would if I walk right there, it's gonna be like up to my waist. I, I can safely walk through there because there's a fence, and you know I know the path by, by heart, so I know where I need to go. But, you know, it's not like, 100 degrees outside. You know what I'm saying? So it's this, water is warm, but it's not like, bath water warm. It's still a little chilly. I can feel the debris like moving around under my feet here. Like all the leaves and stuff. Look at that. That's where that drain was. I mean, here, here's my knee. Like I said, I'm about six foot tall. And it's already up to my knees. So where I'm standing right now is probably about a foot, one to two feet. And that's a hill right there. And that hill is completely submerged. This looks like a totally diff, total different, totally different landscape. It's absolutely insane. I'm actually gonna try to go drive up the road. You see how far back this goes. And this is not the worst. It's actually been higher than this. It's been so high to where I couldn't even go. Like, I can only go this far. It's it's been that high before. Like it's been to about right there on that stump, right at the tip of my finger is. So, this this is pretty close. Like I said, like right where it stops here. Go about another right where that black thing is right there in the ground, that stick. It's gotten to that far. It's gotten to that point before. <clears throat> but it's been a while. It's been about that was back in 2020. Um we had a good we had a squall line of thunderstorms from a cold front. Uh squall line had stalled out over us and uh it just dumped like five inches of rain within like an hour and thirty minutes or so, but maybe less than that, but Well, that was uh, pretty fun. Uh, I'm going to go around, drive around, and look at some other places. And see. Uh, I, have a, I, I know it's going to be bad out there. I know it is. There's going to be roads completely submerged and all. But, uh, yeah. But, anyway. Thanks for watching.